Hi, this is Ron Erickson at Yankee Hill Winery Cooking School. And, uh, you know, let me know how some of the things that you've cooked come out. I've gotten some comments so far. Today we're going to make hummus, and it's a garlic hummus. And it is going to be made with, you just need one can of garbanzo beans. And you can rinse them if you want. We can take a couple out here like this and just set them aside. And then we are going to put in two tablespoons of garlic. You can put more or less depending on what you like. And then I have one teaspoon of cumin. One and a half teaspoons of soy sauce. And one and a half tablespoons of sesame oil. And then we're going to put in some olive oil. Now the olive oil I would put a little bit or a little bit more depending on how you like it. Uh, we're then going to just take the food processor and you can mix this chunky. Some people like it chunky, some like it real smooth. Now here, the advantage of making it yourself is most of the hummus that you buy in the store is about half this much and it's four dollars and this can of beans, this was 58 cents, and then your oils and your flavorings. And you can just make this up so easy and it tastes better. And most of the, uh, you know, as I was saying, most of the hummus is tahini. And so this adds another flavor. Now we could add sun-dried tomatoes to it, we could add a combination of a lot of things. So we'll just run this. And I like some chunks in it. So we'll have that. And then you can taste it and season it if you like. Uh, usually with the uh, sesame oil in that, it is has quite a bit of uh, salt in it already. And then we'll just take a bowl. Get all of this out. And then if you take a spoon and just start in the center and just let it run around like this. And we can just pour a little bit of olive oil in those creases. and then sprinkle some garbanzo beans back over the top so they know what kind of hummus it is. And that's it. Very easy 
make a nice snack. I like to cut up vegetables and dip in it. Uh, you can take crackers and do whatever. And this will keep in the refrigerator for several weeks. So if you make some up, you'll still have it. Okay? To your health. Skull.